What's up everyone, it's Time Around at Tube, and welcome back to another Pokemon concept coverage video. Today, we're going to be taking a look at two trade exclusive evolution Pokemon, Machamp and Golem. With X and Y already introducing Mega Alakazam and Mega Gengar, it seems fitting that the last two also get it. So let's cover the concept of Mega Machamp and Mega Golem. Let's start off with Machamp. Now, if you ever fought off against the Machamp, you know how annoying it can be. With its no guard ability in combination with its powerful move pull of attacks like Dynamic Punch and Stone Edge, you're gonna have to risk something on your team to get rid of it. And while its move pull does give it access to sets that have perfect type coverage, its low speed and decent defenses drop a lot of its potential, and it's looked at as an essentially weaker version of Conkeldur. Machamp's Mega Evolution can go about many ways of raising its potential back up. It should get a large boost to its attack and speed, as well as a smaller boost to its defense and special defense. Being realistic, Game Freak wouldn't just skyrocket Machamp's speed just because it's slow and needs to be faster, but at base 85 speed, Machamp can outspeed a lot of former threats, and with much more offensive power, this thing will tear down walls that it couldn't before, even hit Poudon and Slowbro. And with its improved defenses, it'll take hits better against the opponent's average Pokemon. Sure, it'll still have counters like Talon Flame and Mega Pinsir, but if used correctly, you can get around it, cause you're not always gonna be fighting the opponent's Pokemon head on, and you can catch them on the switch. Which. Anyway, retaining its pure fighting typing, its most popular abilities are actually pretty unique. When I asked you guys on Twitter what ability you thought a Mega Machamp would get, I got a ton of different abilities, some of which are actually new abilities, and the most popular of them are No Guard, Iron Fist, or a new ability focused on punching moves. No Guard, its original ability that it's known for, would work great with Machamp's improved self, especially because it can reliably run moves with lower accuracy, which have added bonuses to make up for its low accuracy, and Iron Fist would really help Machamp deal extra damage as it does have a lot of punching moves from elemental punches to power up punch and bullet punch but in terms of a new punching related ability there are a few ways of going about it one of them is giving priority to punching moves as the pokedex always emphasized how it could throw a thousand punches within seconds or if it got an ability that made punching moves hit several times and both of those may seem fitting but they're overpowered but i'd really like to see Mega Machamp get a new ability it needs its own spotlight like greninja and talon flame Here's a fan design for how Mega Machamp could look. What I like about this design is that the artist focused on making it look wiser with its strength instead of just buffing it up. The first thought when it comes to Machamp Mega Evolving is it gaining more arms, but this design takes a different approach at it and I like it. I'm gonna see it right now. This design is my personal favorite. It grows two more arms, the ridges on its head form in other locations, and the overall design looks actually like how I'd want Mega Machamp to look. It fits in perfectly. And if you think that gaining more arms is too much for a Mega Evolution, just look at Metagross. It gains four arms. But just looking at this design just hypes me up. They need to give Machamp a Mega Evolution. And finally, this last design is a different approach at everything. Instead of growing more arms for direct power, it grows more arms for performance. Its back arm buff up completely for support, making it remind me of Metagross's Mega Evolution. It's a very unique design, and while I'd like Mega Machamp to look more like the previous design, I wouldn't mind it looking like this. Next up is Golem. Now, Golem can be an amazing Pokemon. It has really good physical stats to not only take hits well, but also throw them back, and with Sturdy, it can almost always successfully set up on the opponent. But, the only problem is that its rock and ground typing hinders its defensive potential, and having an open weak spot in its special defense makes it more of a sacrificial or lead Pokemon. There's not much you can do to Golem to improve it overall, but there are things that can be done. The typical thought is to boost its defenses, turn it into a pure rock type, and give it solid rock, but that would literally be a rock version of Mega Agron, and I doubt Game Freak would make two Megas so similar. The stats, typing, and ability really depend on how you look at Mega Golem, so instead of listing the most popular of them off the bat, we're gonna look at how Mega Golem could look like first. Here's a fan design for how Mega Golem could look. It's a very minor upgrade, just becomes bulkier overall. This kind of design suggests it would be the same Pokemon overall with just boosted stats, meaning it would get a large boost to its attack, defense, and special defense, and retain its rock and ground typing, as well as its solid rock ability. But I doubt Golem's Mega Evolution would turn out like this. There's definitely more potential it can tap into. This next design is one you may have seen, as it's a popular design for how Mega Golem could look like. The artist made this design with the idea that Mega Golem would become a rock and fire type with boosted physical stats along with an ability that makes Mega Golem detonate and deal damage upon fainting. Now as much as I like that idea, I just don't see it happening. Even though Golem could learn a few fire moves, it wasn't something Golem was big on, and both defensively and offensively, being a park ground type is much more effective. The ability, being like a less restricted aftermath, seems like a good idea idea though and even though I don't see Golem taking on this it's still possible. 
And finally, these last designs are a completely different take at a possible Mega Golem, and I just really like the concept of them. The idea of Mega Evolution is to unlock a state beyond your final form. Just look at Mega Metagross or Mega Deancey. The concept is that Golem breaks out from within its rock shell, and it's an animation I can definitely see in game, just like Stabilize Gem ripping out of its chest and Slowbro jumping up from the shell's control. This means that Golem would lose a lot from its defenses, but in return gain a lot of speed and offensive power. And like I've always said in older videos, Videos, Mega Pokemon that change a lot interest me the most, like Mega Deancey dropping its defenses to become offensive. Even though it would be fitting for this to become a pure ground type, it doesn't seem possible as Rock is its primary type and it can't lose it. But being a Rock and ground type isn't as bad as you think in this state, as it's no longer a tanky Pokemon that's made for taking hits, but more of a speedy offensive Pokemon, and gaining that stab boost to Rock and ground attacks would benefit it a lot more than you think. If Golem did Mega Evolve, I hope it turns out like this. These two Pokemon definitely deserve Mega Evolutions, and I really do hope that they'll get it in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Speaking of that, if you guys haven't done so, check out the official Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire shirts. They'll be up for a limited time, so be sure to reserve one before it goes off. But anyways guys, that's it for this concept coverage video. Feel free to leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and let me know your thoughts on how you think Mega Machamp and Mega Golem could turn out. There's a lot more Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire coverage to come, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If you want to see the last concept coverage video on Mega Jinx, go ahead and check out the video on the left. You can also hit the subscribe button if you want to be notified each time I upload a video.